This video is ironically late because of workload and uh, other circumstances. <laughs> um, <laughs> we got logs out. Welcome to PMDB. This is a discussion I have Candela with me, and we're going to talk about workload. So, Candela, could you just tell me a bit about how how much workload do you think you have in general? Not long ago, I used to work for different clients, but right now I'm only working for one person, and I am content producing plus uh, managing social media. So those are two big tasks, <laughs> even though I thought they weren't at first. And I'm only doing that at the minute because it just takes most of my time. Mm -hmm. Um, and I don't want to, you know, create this situation where it's just, there's too much to do and yeah. I don't have time for myself. How in the past do you not have time and why is it important that you keep, like, time for yourself? A couple of years ago, like a year and a half ago, I was studying, I was working for this place as well. I was working for two freelance clients and I was working in Lush. After three months, it was just something that was unbearable for me to think about. And I had a mental breakdown and the day after I just spoke to them and I quit. I needed that money, but I decided that it was so much better at that moment to just take care of myself. Like a few of the breaking points for me when I just knew that I had to quit things were because I was in a very deep depressive episode and I knew it had to do with that. Or uh, I fainted or I had a mental breakdown in the street thinking about it, you know, those things had to happen mm -hmm. for me to decide that it was a good idea. Which is too far. Which yeah. is too far. Yeah. I just had to allow myself to have space, you know, and to, okay, I have this job, massive workload, massive. Um, how do I deal with it in a way that that is also going to help me, you know, that is not going to drive me nuts. I mean, the interesting thing for me is like, we've talked about like workload and like the word workload already sounds kind of horrible, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. But like, <laughs> <laughs> but like, I mean, the interesting thing is the, and it's always a term which is used, which is like, you should have like a fine balance between your work and social life, right? But if you kind of in general really enjoy your workload, then that should be something which you find enjoyment in, surely. With time, everything is going to become like very heavy on yeah. your shoulders. Every single thing you do, like you're going to get tired of this, this channel at some point. That passion is never going to be there as huge as it is one time, you know? Oh, yeah, like for sure. it might do this. Yeah, it'll go like, up and down. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and that is fine. My mum. This whole reinventing herself thing, she has decided to, you know, she's doing her journalist job that she's starting to hate, and something that's making her very happy is make lamps. So she just creates lamps, she buys pieces of wood, she buys cables, she buys light bulbs, she creates her little lamps, and then she sells them. It's not big, but it's making her a lot happier than, than the journalist job that. She has to go to 9 till 5, we were sometimes 9 till 8. It's the little steps that there's always something you can do. I think there's a very interesting book. I think it's very easy if you just yeah. write down Tim Ferriss 4 hour week and you'll find it. Yeah, and I'll, probably, I'll, I'll look it up and I'll like, just put it at it is, it is. It is very... I haven't finished reading it because I think it's quite a broad subject. But I think it talks very well about how you need to work smarter, not harder. Alright, um, uh, yeah, we're gonna have to cut it there, uh, cause I gotta get all this gear back. <laughs> um, <laughs> fuck's sake. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, uh, yeah, thanks for coming on, Kendall. Um, <laughs> yeah. Welcome. Yeah, um, new videos each week. This was a delayed video, normally it's Thursday, but, um, yeah, we, we were too busy on Thursday with other things, as we said. But, no, I got that look.